everybody, this is Nolan here, and welcome to another episode of Danganronpa 2 Goodbye Despair. Welcome aboard my ARC. I'm here with my buddy Dylan, and in the last episode, what we did was we, uh, we, uh, finished the entire investigation. I actually wrote everything down on these pieces of paper, and so without further ado, I'm wearing this Nagito jacket in memorial of him, and, uh, let's get right into this. The last class trial? He, he said that, right? He said, last class trial? This can't be the last class trial. Yep. Yeah, I heard it too. He really did say it was the last class trial. What do you think? Should we believe him? Um... Monokuma seems or seemed anxious about the Monokuma timer earlier, right? Two more days. He said something about the killing school trip ending, right? Based, based on, on the time sorry. oh, based on the time limit, this might definitely be the last one. But still. But I can't imagine that it's the real end. Huh? I think Monokuma's real plan might be just beyond that. His real plan? Is Monokuma still planning to make us do something? What could it be? Maybe after putting us through all of this, he's planning to kill the remaining survivors all at once? Well? But still, it's also not a good idea to think about it too much, I think. It's not good idea. It's not good idea. I think we should focus on the class trial, uh, the, the class trial that's waiting for us first. You're right. A class trial for Nagito's murder. Who would have thought? We're pretty screwed. Oh, that's right. I haven't collected my thoughts because we were so focused on this file. I still can't see who killed Nagito. Nagito had a brutal death. But Jesus. Still. Well, you don't have to worry so much. Huh? Right? I mean, we're not fighting this alone, you know? You're right. You're absolutely right. We're not alone. Even if it's a mystery that can't be solved alone. As long as everyone cooperates and works together. Yeah. If we do that, things will turn out fine. Alright, let's do this thing. Let's head on over to Manakuma Rock. For... Well... The trial of Nagito. I'm sad. And scared. Very scared. Damn right. Looks like everyone's here. Huh? huh? Is this it? Shouldn't there be more people? Damn it. Stop it, you're making me depressed. Stupid fool. You're making me depressed. <laughs> um. So, is it going to it is going to happen again? The cruel conflict where we must doubt our we must doubt our friends. <laughs> but but once we're through this, we can go back, right? That's right. That Monokuma BP said so, didn't he? He said this is the last class trial. Damn it. We've been tricked for every step of the way. There's no way I can believe that so easily. Of course not. Why can't you believe it? This guy, the guys who's making us do all this and the one say, is the one saying it, you know? You know right? That's why I'll definitely survive. If we can really go home after we deal with this class trial, right. I'll definitely find out who the killer is, no matter what. Even if I have to pull all out all the stops. What the frick? Why are you here? You haven't realized it yet? That feeling is wanting to leave this island? Thinking like that is Monokuma's twap, you know? Huh? Huh? What are you saying? Got it? There's no way Monokuma will end things here. He's planning something far worse. <sighs> Arr, stop jinxing us! Stop trying to jinx us! I'll you Damn right! Stupid rabbits should just shut up! Everyone, you mustn't run away from despair! Huh? I have finally realized after losing my powers, I've realized that cursing your powerlessness, your fate, uh, fate accomplishes nothing. The possibility may be small, but as long as there's possibility, you must face it. In order to become someone you can be, who can be proud of yourself. So I will fight. Huh? What's your deal? Um. I, I do not really know, but she seems different from before. <laughs> Maybe she read a self-help book. Wait. But her eyes, she looked so determined. You. Shh, determination. <laughs> your, <laughs> your heart's filled with determination. Oh. My bad. Uh, shh, that can't, uh, what can you tell just by looking at those button eyes? <sighs> anyway, make sure you turn off Minimaru. It'd be annoying if you just started talking during the trial. Aw, <laughs> oh, fine. But still. Somehow, I understand what Monokuma's saying, I think. Anyway, let's get going. To the last yeah. class trial. You're right. We need to fight as much as we can. No matter what ho hopeless truth awaits us in the end. Roar. This is the end. <laughs> I kept saying those words to myself over and over within my mind. 
I entered Monokuma Rock. Got to crap crack open a cold one. Me and the boys cracking open a cold one as we're <laughs> doing a class trial. <laughs> just cracks open a cold one. This elevator ride, this will be the last uh, last time for this too, right? I hope so. Well? Let's worry about things after we're finished. You are right. More importantly, we must focus on the class trial before us. Well, I mean, at least they're not going to be... At least they're not going to be doing this forever. The killer managed to kill someone like Nagito. There's no way this is going to go smoothly. I mean, I still can't believe one of us was able to do that. Um, Nagito was problematic in many ways, but he was also a valuable asset during the trials. Yeah, you're That's right. That's what Hajime just said. In fact, during the Funhouse ordeal, we were completely dependent on him. But even if he's gone, the ones who survived need to stand and fight. We must fight. All right. And then the door slowly opened. This bright light greeting us. Is that the light of hope or the light of despair? A deadly class trial. Well now. Well then, now that the chatterbox Nagito is gone, there are only six of you left. Shut the hell up. Enough, just freaking start this already. Hey. Hey, this is uh, this is it, right? This is really the cla last class trial, right? Yep. Yep. It sure is. <laughs> So, you gotta show some enthusiasm and make sure you give it your all! Alright! Didn't I tell you? He said it! This is the end! Now then! Now then, let's get this trial started! This is the last class trial! Let's show some enthusiasm and kill each other! This is the fifth class trial. According to Monokuma, this is also the last class trial. That curtain is about to rise. Nagito Komaeda, the l ultimate lucky student. <sighs> when I first met him, I thought he was a nice guy. He came across as vo very sociable. 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 <laughs> but his true nature held such a demented thought process that was nothing like his outward appearance. He said he believed in hope more than anything else. He said he was yearning for a powerful hope. He looks that like could an overcome old grandpa. Any despair. My grandma. <laughs> He said he would hope that even help despair, just to prove that hope will never lose despair. And he said he'd be a stepping stone for hope. His way of thinking was completely screwed up, but there were also times he saved us too. Oh god. Someone like him was killed. That was the end of him. Well, let's... And I have no idea at all who did it, but... It was one of us. There's no way we can't end this without knowing. We will be consumed by despair. That's why we absolutely have to find out. That person who finished off Nagito. The killer who murdered Nagito. He will be avenged! In order to return from this despair alive, we need to reach the truth. And if Monokuma says this is really the last class trial, that's all the more reason we need to do this. And so, this life-threatening trial, filling with hope and despair, the last one, has begun. Epicness! Okay, I'm actually not gonna save, because I already saved a bit ago, and I'm trying to save up my save slots. Okay, alright, let's set our, uh... E-handbook, let's open the e-handbook. Well, I think, I feel like I bought everything, but... You we'll... still have two skills oh, from when you talk to Shiaki. Yeah, we'll see. Alright, uh... Oh yeah, you're right. Okay, so we have two left. Should we just do upshift? I don't think they can. Um, I don't know. I don't. I don't know. If, I think you should get moon salt. Okay. Increases jumping power. That's important. Mm -hmm. That's probably good. All right. Well, we got them all there. Mm -hmm. um, we didn't get every skill, but whatever. That's fine. Okay. Um, let's set our skills. What does she code do? Uh, the time limit don't doesn't decrease even if you shoot a statement with the silencer. That's a, that's really good. That's All amazing. Right. Even uh, if now the time limit doesn't decrease if you mess up or something. Yeah. All right. Here we go. All right. Let's 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 do this. Now then, let's begin with a simple explanation of the class trial. I need laser focus. During the class trial, you will present your arguments for who oh. the killer is and <laughs> vote for who did it. Blood. If and you vote correctly, then only the blackened will receive punishment. 
But if you pick the wrong person, I'll punish everyone besides the Blackened. And that person will earn the right to leave this island. Oh, my! Monami? My cute little sister? You're awfully quiet. What's happened to you? You've ascended the ladder of adulthood wow. and reached the moon? Because you're a rabbit? Oh, jeez. <laughs> that's, uh, that's a little insulting. Whoa. Oh, she's... N oh, she's... Oh, God. Oh, God. What? That's kind of creepy. Wow, don't punch... Okay. <laughs> Whoa, she's still standing there. Muda, muda. <laughs> I feel bad for Monomi. You're right. Now is not the time for me to horse around with Monomi. The class trial has started, after all. The victim this time is Nagito, who is attempting to reveal the traitor for everyone's sake. Who in the world killed him? I'm so curious. If he was killed for trying to reveal the traitor, that traitor is obviously the killer. They were trying to shut Nagito up. No, that might not be it. Huh? Are you trying to protect the traitor? They didn't call out when we were in danger. Wait. Don't tell me you're the traitor. Uh oh. Don't say something so stupid. Don't say something so stupid. I'm the traitor. Vegeta. Vegeta. <laughs> now that's more like it. Why don't you guys hurry and start arguing already? The traitor, the killer who murdered Nagito, is here, right? Are they the same person? Or. Okay, wow, that just happened fast. Let's look at everything. Torture wound, survival knife, duct tape, monokuma plushie, monokuma panels, oil lighter, monokuma's account. And that's it. Alright. The killer the bullets, didn't take Nagito's right? mouth to shut him Let's up. see all the bullets you got. I'm telling you, they were torturing him. The reason Nagito's body was covered with wounds. It's because the killer tortured Nagito. Right, so, so the so torture wounds up. might actually be important to this. What were they trying to find out by torturing him? Definitely the bomb's hiding place. If so, the suspect... Not at all. Is whoever found the bomb first? No, probably that not right either. Yuhiko. Well, actually, I'm mean... I found it by coincidence. There's no way I'd torture someone. This, uh, that's wrong too, actually. So... Why did the killer have to torture Nagito? No! Uh, you don't have to reason. The reach. killer didn't take Nagito's mouth to shut him up. I'm telling you, they were torturing him. The reason Nagito's body was covered with wounds... It's because the killer tortured Nagito. Right, the killer did so torture Nagito. Was so beat sure up? That? But that's right, so were we're not shooting it at the right torturing one. Him? Definitely the bomb's hiding place. But the bomb's hiding place? That's so, also wrong. The suspect is whoever found the bomb first. Sorry, I, I have to pause it. Uh, survival knife. That was Fuyuhiko. I, I found it by coincidence. There's no, no he didn't. Way I torture someone. Okay, so I know the first one and last one are incorrect. The reason Nagito's body. Well, he's is he's right though. So that's why he was but so he's right. I, I wouldn't shoot that at him. So, is whoever found why would you Fuyuhiko? torture someone? I found There's no way I torture God. someone. But he was right about the them torturing. I'm it, telling you, doesn't make sense though. It's because duct tape was covering his mouth. No, what the heck? The duct tape was covering his mouth. It's so speed. Okay, but can I tell you something? Torturing someone is just hurting them. No, torturing someone is hurting them so they can say something, so they can give out information. That's not what I it's get from it. It's a method of getting knowledge. That's not what I get from it, but okay. But that's just, that's all in perspective, though. Tape, so that's all in perspective. Able to confess anything. If he was it's okay, I spent like an hour trying to find they that first one. His mouth like that. I'm prepared. Oh, come on. Oh my god. Oh, well, hey, look. It's you. Oh, yeah. I just realized it. It's a trap. A trap? Stupid Hajime, you got caught in that trap. Stupid. Stupid. Oh, okay, this can be hard. I bet. I well, I don't have time to look at these, so that's gonna suck. It's fine. I'll figure it out. 
Like you said, if Nagito's mouth was taped shut, you obviously assume he couldn't talk, right? But that was the trap! He wanted to hide the fact that he got interrogated. Alright. But if you tape his mouth shut, how is he supposed to answer anything? Pay attention, this is how it went. First, the killer tortured Nagi and got information about the bomb's location. Then, after they killed him, they duct taped his mouth shut. Oh, wow. <laughs> Whew, that was close, you guys. Thanks to me, you guys didn't get caught in the trap. So after they killed him, they duct taped his mouth shut? Let's see which one is wrong. That's actually wrong. Wait, that is wrong. After they killed him. After they killed him. Hey, After they killed this him. This is how it went down. First, the killer tortured Nagi and got his pen. After they killed him. After they killed him is the wrong one. All right. Uh, duct tape. Duct tape. Duct tape. That's the one. Damn it! Frick! I didn't have time. Like you said, Nagito's mouth was taped shut. You obviously assumed he couldn't talk, right? But that was the trap. He wanted to hide the fact that he got. Really, I have to go all the way back. All right, whatever. I can't back down. Oh yes. All right, epic. But if you tape his mouth shut, how is he supposed to answer anything? Come on, come on. I already know this. Pay attention. This is how. First, the killer tortured Nagi and got information about the bomb. Then, after they killed him, allowed yes. him to cut through those words. All right. Yeah, I remember that. Good job. No. Oh, There's whoa. no doubt Nagito's mouth was covered <laughs> with duct tape before he was beat up. What did you say? Who cares about the duct tape? We might as well settle this with rock, paper, scissors. We don't need to play a game. It's clear the duct tape was on his mouth before the torture even began. Why do you always side with Hajime? Do you have a crush on him or something? No, it's just that you're wrong all the time. Are you in elementary school or something? You were with us when I peeled <laughs> the duct tape off Nagito's mouth. The blood on Nagito's face wasn't under the duct tape, remember? The blood on his face came from his arm wounds. Which means the duct tape was on his face before his arms were even wounded. And the duct tape had a lot of crinkles around his mouth. He must have been struggling to open his mouth under the duct tape. Perhaps the duct tape was used so we wouldn't be able to scream. Then it's like I said at the beginning. The tape- However, if they wanted to seal his mouth, they did not need to hurt him with such ferocity. They probably had a deep grudge against- uh, Speak for yourself, Sonya. I bet that's- I bet you're the one who did it. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Then, are you saying the killer was trying to make him suffer? If so, it's friggin' crazy. Did they go psycho or something? No, they didn't just go crazy. Whoever did this must be one crafty bastard. If not, they wouldn't have taken the time to set fire to the crime scene and destroy all the evidence. Mm -hmm. The warehouse fire was for destroying evidence? Yes, uh, yeah. I can't think of any other reason. But who could have done that? When the fire occurred, everyone in this room was gathered in front of the warehouse. Yeah, and right after I opened the warehouse door, the flames started burning from the very back. Which means, it is plausible to think that nobody here set the fire. The killer isn't one of us, but that's not the case, huh? I mean, it's wishful thinking. Even if it was only a coincidence, the timing was just too perfect. Based on the pattern up until now, we should suspect that some kind of setup was used for this. Some kind of setup? Like what? I... I do not know that, but that has been the pattern before. Oh, she's... little... okay. Miss she does know. You have such an amazingly high intellect. Alrighty then. Let's think about this. Wow, based on he's what so Sonya clueless, is. man. Is that okay? This is an amazingly low intellect. Huh? Nothing. Uh. Damn right it is. The reason for the fire, huh? They're right. We need to clear that up first. All right. So what's the reason for the fire? Wait, we already know that. <laughs> I already literally know what it is. It's the oil lighter. <laughs> All right. Let's. Yeah, it's the one that started the fire. I already read that. I'm gonna just. The direct cause of the fire was the oil lighter found at the crime scene, right? No, that's wrong. Some kind of setup. <laughs> lit the curtain on fire with the lighter. What the? Some kind of setup? 
Did they use the oil as an improvised fuse? They probably oh. just threw the lighter. Based on the shape of that oil lighter, it can stand upright while the flame is... If they tipped over the... It could have ignited the curtain. Some way. Maybe they used invisible thread. Wow. There should have been a way to tip it over with sound waves. Or perhaps opening the door caught intense wind pressure to tip over the lighter. Okay, that's wrong, that's wrong, that's wrong, that's wrong. I'm trying to see which one is the right. Cause of the fire well, oil lighter is obviously the, the one that I'm shooting. The killer used something lit the curtain on fire. Some kind of setup? Did they use the oil as an improvised piece? Alright, well, I was thinking that's what they were using it for. But, I think that they... The cause of the, the oil lighter found at the crime The killer used something lit the curtain on fire. Some kind of setup? Did they use the oil? They probably just threw the lighter. Based oh, they might have. Of that oil, it can stand upright. If they tipped over the lock, it could have ignited the curtain. Some way? Maybe they used invisible thread. Uh, that's weird. There should have been a way to tip it over with sound waves. Sound waves? Or perhaps opening the door caused intense wind pressure to tip over the lighter. Intense wind pressure. Okay, so Shiaki talks. No. There should have been a way to tip it over with sound waves. Or perhaps opening the door caused... Yeah, boy. Okay, yeah, I see. I also agree that opening the door is what started the fire. Just as I thought, it was <laughs> yeah, wind pressure. A dust devil blown here from glorious Japan. No, no, no wind it wasn't. Pressure. <laughs> they probably used the Monokuma panels. A yes, huge number of, of course. Over Monokuma panels were found at the crime scene, right? It looked like they were scattered everywhere. But some were laying on top of each other in a single line. That's what tipped just it over. A single line leading from the warehouse. So they just kind of stood it upright door. in front of them, and then boom, 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 boom. Does that mean anything? The killer probably arranged those Monokuma panels to create a domino effect. That's what I'm saying, bro. Effect. You mean those tiles kids play with by lining them up and tipping them over? Yes. No, they obviously mean Beyblades. Yeah, I mean Beyblades. In place of man. those tiles, Stupid the killer used the Monokuma <laughs> panels. So when we open the warehouse door, the first panel topples into the second. Ooh, let's get a good old... There we go, look at that. Just the whole map of it. Alright, well that's enough. And from there, <laughs> they fell like dominoes until they reached the lighter at the end. But wouldn't it be obvious that those big panels were falling over? That's probably why they turned off the lights in the warehouse. So we wouldn't notice them. Oh man, they're smart. So the reason the warehouse every was detail dark just matters to, to them, the man. And one more thing, there was something else the killer did to hide the domino effect, right? The killer did one other thing to hide the domino effect. Oh. Um. I mean, I would think this, but that doesn't like just to just distract them. But maybe that's kind of dumb. Uh, that's the only thing I can really think of. I see. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. You were talking about the MP3 player, right? That hymn blaring throughout the warehouse masked the sound of the falling panel. Oh, well, okay, that, yeah. Okay, well. <laughs> the inside of the warehouse felt even darker because our eyes were still used to the bright sunlight outside. I love this music, man. I listened to it last night. Mwah. Just, mwah. Just... A piece of art. Within Sorry. that darkness, a loud hymn will blare throughout the warehouse at full volume. Hey, oh, hey, did you guys hear something? Yeah, it's really damn loud. It's not you to like listening to this depressing crap. <laughs> no, I'm talking about the music. And as if on cue, it suddenly started. Oh God. <laughs> That's it. So the strange sound was actually the sound of the panel. That's flying. crazy. That's like a, the, the biggest setup ever, just for the creepiest murder. But those sounds <laughs> not the only strange thing, right? Looking back on it, it was also strange when we opened the door to the warehouse. It's fine, open it slowly. No, that's not the problem. Seriously, it'll be fine. With those words, Akane brushed off everyone's warnings and slowly opened the door to the warehouse. Clatter, clatter, clatter. Huh? It's not opening. Is there something blocking the door? I can barely open it. I knew it, it's a trap. Seriously, just stop it, okay? I did not tell you, it, it'll be fine. I just gotta use a little more force. Whatever, to open it slowly. Akana ignored their protests and with a mighty kick, it 
Screw it open. Whatever. Bam! Through the door. <laughs> the door flew the door open. By a Monokuma panel. And when we open the door, the domino effect. How is it hard to open it? Panels eventually reach the lighter. If there was just a just a cardboard panel just right. How is that hard to open? <laughs> yeah. To push. And like, that's okay. how the warehouse caught on fire. At least, that's how it looks. You don't look so sure. At the time. Akane mentioned that she could barely open the door because the panel was blocking it. No, right? how could that be? With the blocked doorway, there wasn't enough space for a person to fit through, right? Is that a problem? It's a major problem. Is that a problem? I mean, we're gonna have ourselves a happy little accident. To the warehouse. <laughs> if that door is the only entrance to the warehouse, I see. So the problem Shiaki's talking about is we couldn't see inside. The killers, the killer couldn't have left it. Or left, sorry. They couldn't have hidden inside. They could have hidden inside. We could have taken any merch. <laughs> the killer couldn't have left. Well, if that's the only place. I see. Yeah, they, like if there were only one place to go, if then. The panel was so close to the door that it could barely be opened. The killer inside the warehouse wouldn't be able to leave, right? So they set it up beforehand. I was. I'm thinking that. Does that mean they were hiding inside? Or. Who? We were all outside the warehouse, you know. Exactly. <laughs> Based on the patterns up until now, I believe some kind of setup was used. You don't have to think so hard. There's actually only one person who could have possibly done this. Huh? You don't mean... But... but if that's true, this um, murder... Um, Hajime? What do you mean? The person who set up the domino effect inside the warehouse, there's only one person that could have done that. What the frick? I like that. Okay, what I, I like how they just like, oh... Got to figure it out now. All right. So, so, so she was with them. She was with. He was Frank. Okay, they were all there. But who was at the? Oh, I'm just gonna guess. That's all I'm gonna do. No, Nolan. They're talking about the only person inside the warehouse that could have set it up. Well, then who did? Bra. Bra. It's it's Biakibo. It's Mikon. It's Peko. Nah, it's Mahiru. How was it Nagito? He did it himself? This is my answer. Why? What the heck? What if it was Nagito? Why'd you bring him up? He's the victim, you That's know. That's what I'm saying. He wasn't just the victim. I guess he killed himself huh? then. No. Not just the victim? What does that mean? He was the victim. And he was the perpetrator, too. I I'm not good at everything, guys. Are you saying this was a suicide? <laughs> It's okay. Don't be stupid. His body was covered in torture wounds. Or did you already forget? Are, are you saying those were all self-inflicted? But Nagito might do something like that. Don't you think? He hates himself so much. That's not the issue. He was tied up, remember? That's what I'm that's what I was Even thinking for too. A like Nagito, it'd be impossible for him to tie up his own arms and legs. Yeah. You're right. Exactly. Y yeah, as long as you understand. It seems we need to discuss how Nagito was able to tie himself up. That's- okay, that's why I was just like, he was tied up and how could he have done it? Need to discuss? Oh my god. That's not don't expect me all. to choose no if I don't know No matter how much you think it about it, it's clearly impossible. Like he said, it seems impossible if you think about it, but I feel like I'm overlooking something. Fine. <laughs> Torture runes, burn, burn rope, survival knife, duct tape, monokuma plushie, monokuma panels, oil lighter. Alright. To actually tie up your own arms and legs. That's obviously impossible! Oh, well Tying that's just the weird. legs is one thing, but... Tying both arms would be impossible. You couldn't do much with the free arm. It'd be impossible if you were by yourself. How about if you use your teeth? Unless he wasn't by himself. Or if you use your front tail. Dirty joke. Is that a dirty joke? <laughs> All right. Uh, so I think it's what Fuyuhiko said. So he was with someone, maybe. To actually, tie up your own arms and legs. All right. The torture That's ones show that. Tying just the legs, tying both arms. Would... You couldn't do much with it. It'd be impossible if you were by yourself. Oh, but the torture wounds show that he, somebody could have been there to torture him, though. Why can't that be right? Why can't that be right? Ah. Uh. To actually tie up your own arms and legs. My freaking no, space ball. Nope. 
Hold on a sec. Isn't that premise flawed? What? I mean, it's no mistake that his arms and legs were... No, it shouldn't have been both of his arms. The rope on his right arm was completely burnt up. Based on that, you can't say he was tied up. That was just burned by the fire. He should have been tied up before... It burned because of the fire. Like you said, it might look like that. But that was part of the trap. There's concrete evidence that proves it. The proof that the burnt load by Nagisa's right arm is a trap. Uh... Hold on. The knife in his right hand, his right... His sleeve doesn't show it because it's not burned. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess it was then. No, wait, the what? sleeve! But the sleeve isn't right because it, it didn't show right. that it was burned. It said it wasn't exactly. burned. Exactly! Exactly! It wasn't burned! That right, means that's the, not evidence. Look, that means that the, the right fire... Sleeve didn't burn his sleeve. When, it, when the whole place lit on fire, it didn't burn his sleeve. That's not evidence, That though. is that's evidence. That's not even good enough. That is evidence! Rawr! Jesus. That right. is evidence. See, if, if it would've, it would've burned the entire rope, whoosh, some of his sleeve, too, but it didn't. Right. He lit, he burned the rope himself and then blew it out to make it look like the entire fire burnt the rope. A burn like okay. this, no matter how you think about it. Rawr! Jesus Christ. That rope was burned in advance, so it would look like it was burned in the fire. Then Nagito's right arm wasn't tied up, right? <laughs> he yeah, that should be the case. <laughs> Monokuma wants to strangle you! Oh, God. Hey, Jimmy, that's awesome! I'll let you cop a feel if you want. Akane, you should not give it away for free. Make sure they pay you first. Just don't do it at all. <laughs> Please go. Fine. I just got to get a Benjamin from him before I let him touch me, right? That doesn't make any That's sense. That's not what I meant. I'm talking about Nagito. I mean, even if his right hand wasn't tied up, the knife was still stabbed into it, you know. It's impossible to stab a knife into your right hand with your right hand. Ah, that much is obvious. How'd you make it? You, you tricked me. Unless you use your fingers and just go... Boom, boom, and just stab yourself. <laughs> Not only did she try to charge me, now she wants the money back? What the heck? Uh, hold on. There should be a way. Then hurry up and spill it. If it's something lame, I'll make you give back to Benjamin with 10,000% interest. Benjamin. What does that even mean? Um, a way to stab yourself in the right hand using only your right hand. It's okay. There's definitely an answer for this. Oh my god, man. <laughs> How do you stab your right hand with only your right hand? I, I stop, 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 stop. All right. Even Let me if just Nagito's look. right hand was free, how could he stab his right hand with his right hand? If he threw the knife into the air and let the knife fall, I mean, luck would, would have it, right? <laughs> Luck would have that, I guess, but no. Is he a throwing knife expert? Let's Maybe just see. Maybe he propped the knife somehow? <laughs> he slammed his right stop, hand stop, down stop. on it? Propped it onto what? <laughs> if he just propped, he could have used his bound left hand? If you're tied up, your arms won't bend that easily. Yeah. Even if his left hand could even reach his right hand. Benjamin. I already... back that Benjamin. I know, right? Even if Nagito's right hand Wait, was... Wait, so I think it's the second right one. With... If he threw the knife he into propped the it up. He propped it up with what? And let the knife fall. Oh, wait. Could he stab his hand that way? Is he a throwing knife expert? Maybe he propped it and slammed his right hand down on it. Oh, I what? With that. Okay. <laughs> the life-size Monokuma plushie. He must have used that to prop the knife. Makes sense. That's why there was a big hole in the plushie's stomach. He inserted Man. the knife handle into that hole to prop he it up. He literally just like then turned around and just went. Onto it. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh god. If that's it. He had to place the plushie near him, and it also explains the mysterious blood on the plushie. So the blood, blood on the plushie. So after he stabbed the knife, blood on the plushie. Right that's why I was being a retard, just going. I, I <laughs> Jeez Louise. <laughs> so that's the trick. But for a moment, I seriously thought Monokuma died or something. A bleeding plushie is super scary. It's got the same fear factor as a doll whose hair grows too long. What? After that doesn't hand, happen, though. He no longer needed the plushie, so he cast it off toward the fire's origin point. Ew, yeah. He probably thought the yep. fire would incinerate it and destroy the evidence. He killed himself, so probably. Now, I still don't know, though. We'll see. I get what you're saying about the wound on his right hand, but there's still one huge problem. 
the spear. Basically, you're saying Nagito committed suicide by impaling himself with a spear, right? If you think about the order, oh God, getting yeah. killed by the spear should have been the last thing to happen to Nagito. If that's true, how is that possible? He can't grab a spear with his right hand if a knife is stabbed into it and his left hand was all tied up. Then he probably took the spear first, and as he endured the pain, he stabbed <laughs> the knife into his right hand. <laughs> yes, totally. There is a limit to his constitution. If you got penetrated by something so big and thick, you would die instantly. <laughs> so oh. big and thick? Still endured the pain, though. I'm sorry, I... Didn't catch all that. Shut up. <laughs> like I said, if you got penetrated by something so big and thick, you would die instantly. Stop. Stop. Hey, Shut up. <laughs> I need to record it. For reasons. Hey, bastard, you better cut <laughs> it out. Like she said. Oh in my that condition, god. It's very to stab yourself. He's so spear. creepy. If he no. hurts, use a spear with a knife stab into your right hand. Gundam. While your left hand is tied up. So you're saying it's impossible. But no matter what yes. I think, yes, I, am. I can't believe Nagito's death was caused by someone else. I also agree with that. To think that one of us could kill someone with such cruelty, I could never believe that. You say you can't believe it? <laughs> you just don't want to believe it, right? But that's why you keep getting betrayed over and over again, right? Same shut up. For this time shut too. up, Monokuma. You just shut your mouth. It's against yeah, the rules shut to up. interfere with everyone. If you even think about doing anything, I have a plan of my own. Oh. That's kind of creepy. Monami sassing me. But Monami sassing me. Monokuma said, we've been betrayed over and over Frick again. Frick quid pro quo. Frick quo pro, Clarice. This might also be the same. Calling this a suicide takes too much for granted. And it's too convenient. And are you saying there is a killer among us, Kazuichi? Uh, of course, that doesn't include Miss Sonia and me. As Kazuichi said, it's true we've been constantly betrayed. But even if I'm betrayed again, I still want to believe in everyone. No matter how many times I may be betrayed, I still want to believe in everyone. I also want to believe that there's no killer. But suicide is unimaginable. Do you really think so? But you said it too. It'd be impossible for him to stab himself with a spear in his condition. I did say difficult, but I never said impossible. Huh? I feel huh? that there's... Some way he could have stabbed himself with that spear. Oh, I already know. What kind of way? I think I already know, actually. I don't know. I think I actually already know. Ooh. You don't know. It's impossible I think I to know. figure out by myself. The so cord! let's think about it together. The cord! That's on the back of it! We made it this far up till now. Why was there blood on the girder? Sa uh, something. Everyone I don't know. Working together. She's right. We've made it through several ordeals up until now by doing that. Then even now. Right, let's do this. All right. Oh. Okay. Wow. 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 Uh. uh all right. Well, let's see which ones we have to work with. Uh, blood on the left hand, duct tape. Oh, we're just still working with the same exact freaking ones. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> I guess. How did Nagito stab himself? Let's work together and think this through. When the spear stabbed Nagito, his right hand was covered by the knife, right? Right. He was only able to move his left hand, but his left hand was also tied. And that rules out his left hand. If that's the case, the only other way is... He used his teeth? He used his teeth? Or maybe he used his front tail. Shut up, Akane. Shut up. I She's wrong. I tails that get hard when they're grabbed. What? I'm blushing Miss Sonia's That ruins awesome. okay. That's why are they really? They just okay, well that all of that's wrong, man. <laughs> Let's work together and think this through. Oh god, she's happy. Nagito. His right hand was covered by the knife, right? Yes, right. He was only able to move his left hand, but his left hand was also tied up. Then that rules out his left hand. If that's the case, the only other way is. He used his teeth? Or maybe uh, he used his well. tail. I know guys have tails that get hard when they're grabbed. What are you saying? The blushing Miss Sonia is freaking awesome! Look, all of... Uh, really? That's the end of it? Think this through. Covered? When the spear stabbed Nagito, his right hand was covered by the knife, right? Maybe it's left hand. 
Fine. He was only able to move his left hand. But his left hand was on. And that rules out his left hand. Dark hard. What? No, what? Wrong. Wait, left hand rules out his left hand. What? His left hand rules out still his left hand. hand. Just forget it. That was dumb. That he used his left hand. <laughs> Why? What I mean, the heck is wrong with this up, game? You know? But there was something off about his left hand. The blood stain on the oh, palm of well, his hand. Oh, really? Don't you think it looked somewhat strange? No, yeah. Okay. So it looked strange. Doesn't mean it has anything to do with that. Well, yeah. The See, he was holding the cord with his Beyond that hand, the blood stain but cuts it should have. Right? I I don't know. It should have too. It should have been. No, it should have. It's not that it's it's not specific enough. It's too yeah, vague. No, you're right. You're it's right. It's too vague. No, you're right. His left hand. It's not the only on His left it's hand. Fine. It's fine. It's right, can, left hand. Okay. <laughs> Look, there's blood on the back of his hand, around the middle joints of his fingers. So he grabbed it like this. <laughs> like you said, it looks like an unnatural blood stain. But what's, we might need to uh, think. He was like waving goodbye and just. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. His palm, and the back of his hand. Wait, so that means this part was covering it, and so the bottom part, and then his fingers, okay. What was Nakito's left hand doing when the blood splattered? Gripping. The back of his hand was exposed. Open. <laughs> Gripping. I see. Firmly right. grasp it. Firmly grasp it. When the blood splattered, he was probably gripping with his left hand. That's why there's such a strange looking blood stain on his palm. Is he wow. grabbing his front tail? Left hand. Here's wow, she ruined the he last. She ruined the spear. Shove your left hand. Oh my god. Oh, oh she your left hand. Now that you mention that. it, Shove your left compared hand to the rest of his right body, <laughs> the wounds the on his left arm are pretty mild. And turn yourself he around. probably made his Sorry. wounds mild on purpose. <laughs> So he could keep his strength while he gripped the spear. You can see the, the where there's no blood. But on the even if too. he held the spear with his tied up left hand, it'd be impossible for him to stab himself. But he did. That's right. That's hey, the problem. Hey, Chucky, what do you think? Hey, don't tell me you're getting sleepy. At times like this, Snore. you should always strike from a good angle, just like fixing an old TV. Oh, I got you're it. You're an old TV. Uh huh. Really? Yeah. Like I thought. It's no mistake that not She's the ultimate detective. Spear, I think. Hey, why couldn't we say that in a better way? Besides, I, I know. Hey guys, hey guys, it's me, Hajime. His left hand. Okay. Who's out his left hand? What's important is what section of the spear he was gripping. Hajime really is a monkey. <laughs> what section of the spear was he holding on to? Oh, duh. Literally, what else was he holding on to? See the blood on the cord that he was gripping. How else would he? Have blood on the cord. Instead of the handle. Nagito must have been holding on to the cord. There was a metal weight at the tip of the cord, but there were blood stains on that part too. All right. Plus, the joint between the weight and the cord had a blood stain shape like it was cut off by something. Isn't the size of that cut off section about the same size as a human fist? Ah, you're right. So this is the part Nagito was gripping, huh? And then the blood that was supposed to end up here ended up getting on Nagito's left hand. Exactly. But why is it so important to know which part of the spear he was gripping? You're not gonna say he gripped the tip of the cord, swung the spear around, and stabbed no. himself, right? No, we're saying that he used okay, he used the cord to do it, but we're not saying he that swung it around. The clue to solve this mystery resides, right, Chiaki? I am sorry. Of course, this mystery will not be solved that easily. He tied it to the girder. Mm hmm. Hmm. Nakito was gripping the cord extending from the butt of the spear of his left hand. <laughs> the butt? But from there, how would he stab himself in the stomach with the spear? Hmm. Hmm. It seems we are stuck. <laughs> Shall we have it tea time? It seems we are stuck. I have like fallen this. and I can't how get up. To? The plan to think one step at a time instead of expecting the answers all at once. That's a long plan name. One step You're at a time. Plan name. Wow. What does that mean? Let's focus on the spear first. Namely, where it was and how it was positioned just before it impaled Nagito. You how impaled it was Nagito. Positioned. Uh -huh. Nagito was facing up and the spear was stabbed through his stomach. Nagito was just like, ah! <laughs> so if it's just before that. That's it! Could it be? The state of the spear and the fact that Nagito was holding the tip of the cord attachment. If I put those words together and think about it, I should be able to figure out where the spear was and what state it was in before it stabbed Nagito. It was dangling or hanging. It says it. Oh, 
Logic time! I thought it was, okay, Hangman's Gambit. <laughs> I thought that's what it was gonna like have us do. Hangman's Gambit. It like gave us the answer. It just hangs. <laughs> Funny. I know. I'm hilarious. <laughs> I can jump. Oh, uh, look how. <laughs> hey, look out, Hajime. <laughs> okay. Does a backflip and falls and dies. Uh oh, stinky. Obviously, it's gonna be. Oh, okay. Wee! All right. Question one: Where was the spear just under? Okay, where's the spear impaired Nagito? Just under Nagito, above Nagito, above him. Duh! I already know it's dangling above him. Yay! I know I'm right. All right, let's let's not let's not be. Whoa! Whoa there, horsey! Uh uh. Uh oh. Stay away from the red. <laughs> red bad. The red one or the blue one? Oh, jeez. We're not just two. Ah! Uh -huh. Don't touch me. <laughs> Alright, this is the question. Alright, All right, question two. Besides the spear, what else was above Nagito? Sprinklers, a ceiling girder. A stuffed do, 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 do. Dude, I actually thought about this, this part the most for some reason. Because the ceiling girder kind of messed with my head. Okay. Obviously not Monokuma plushie was just T-posing above Nagito. <laughs> yes. <laughs> really? <sighs> I'm not good at these. I freaking... <laughs> Stay away. Ah, why am I... Uh... It's just like, I'm like, eh, which way? All right. All right. <laughs> I got past those, though. All right, question three. What item connects bow spears and the ceiling girder? Oh, I can tap it? Okay. The rope on Nagito's right hand. Uh, the spear's cord. Spear's cord. Do, 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 do. All right. Well, that's enough. <laughs> oh. God, you're telling you're telling me. You're telling me. Okay. That sucked. <laughs> Whatever. Alright. It's all coming together. You know what else is coming together? You stupid logic dive. The spear in no, it was fun. As he was laying face up. It must have been perpendicular I was flexing my before. calf the whole time. I was just like <laughs> in the middle of the air? If not, he Getting into it. Himself, perpendicular. Did he have some sort of ESP? <laughs> ESPN. That'd be awesome, but he probably used the ceiling girder directly above him. Nagito probably slung the cord over the ceiling girder, and using that as a support. Uh. He hoisted the spear directly above him. He gripped it with his left hand. He firmly grasped it in his left let hand. Go of the cord. Oh. The spear would have fallen. Firmly grasped it. Up. Uh. I noticed a slight red streak on the ceiling girder. It probably got smeared there during street. the setup. That's the blood on the cord up. probably rubbed off on the ceiling girder as the spear was falling. So, how about it? Using this method, Nagito could have impaled himself with the spear. Are you serious? He really committed suicide? That's crazy. Like that? That's it? He it's crazy, but there's still so much that spear left. So he could commit case. suicide like that. If someone well, else that's like this, this is like half the case. There's no reason so we're almost done with the trouble half. just to kill someone with a spear. I agree. When I was investigating this case, I kept thinking over and over how strange it was. Why did the killer use the knife and the spear so differently? So you're saying he needed to use that spear to pull off his trick? Then wow, this is for real. He this is really real life. Committed he really suicide? killed himself. Well, that's not. Wait, why are they so sad? There's no killer. I have decided that I want to die. <laughs> There's no killer on his body. That was all him. Yeah. Not just that. He did all that while he was gripping a spear. Wow, he's crazy. <laughs> oh, yeah. That spear should not so have casual, stabbed Nagito until yeah. the very end. Uh. Which means Nagito wounded himself while he was gripping that spear, right? God. Did he put the duct tape on his mouth too? He probably covered his own mouth so he wouldn't. He did that to himself. Yeah. 
Did he need to go that far? That's beyond crazy. Why would he do that to himself? This is Nagi Toad. That, yeah, this is Nagi Toad. He was probably trying to get us to make a mistake. By committing a suicide that looked like a murder, he was trying to steer us toward the wrong answer. Scott was to get us all executed. Whoa. And that's why he stabbed himself over and over again. Did he want us to die that bad? That's messed up. It's seriously so messed up. Yeah, that's our Nagi Toad. Jeez, now we're starting to feel a little sympathetic towards him. How stupid of me. I completely underestimated his capacity for malice. A mind-boggling malice that threatens us even after he's died. That's the form his malice took. I had forgotten all about it until now. If he was here now, he'd probably be sneering However, at me. However, there is one thing I still do not understand. He said he would reveal the traitor, right? Whatever became of that? He was probably planning to kill the traitor along with the rest of us. So why did he not just do that in the first place? Because he did well, he didn't want to get executed? But he killed himself anyway, so why would he if care? If he had no qualms with killing everyone, he did not have to cause a bomb scare to reveal the traitor. I bet the bomb scare was part of the strategy behind this trick. He made us split up and search for a bomb so none of us would have an alibi. He created a scenario where any of us could have killed him. He tried to make us doubt each other. It tried to hide the truth behind his suicide. Did he cause a bomb scare for that reason alone? He's a fucking bastard who killed himself for his delusions of grandeur. It's not that unthinkable. You are right, I suppose. Yeah, it appears we've come to a conclusion. Mm. Bastard Nagito committed I mean, suicide. No, they so haven't. haven't gone with the Hmm. Well, we be know be he killed himself. Uh, they know he killed himself, so... <laughs> You're not satisfied yet? No, I agree that Nagito killed himself, but I feel like there's something that doesn't make sense. Well, okay, well, the thing is, if they already figured out what happened, why does the, why do they have to carry on the trial with extra details? Because where does the poison come in? Where does anything it's come probably in? Just that's, my imagination. Well, where does the mo notebook come in? You're right. I guess that's why they use the same truth bullets. Why? I mean, I sort of understand what she's talking about. I don't think it's a mistake to assume that Nagito committed suicide, but... Why do I feel so uneasy about it? Is it because we don't know who the traitor is, or...? So what are you gonna do? Is it okay to proceed with the voting do? time? What are you gonna do? <laughs> gonna what are you do? Thinking, Connie? Well, there's no doubt Nagito's death stop, is stop. suicide. Oh well, I guess my gut is wrong sometimes. <laughs> I'm gonna eat your black bean eyes. You're right. It is not <laughs> as though we can draw any other conclusion. <laughs> It's okay to end it here, huh? That means we're done with this last class trial and we can leave this island, right? It's okay to read such a happy ending, right? Then it's okay? It's okay to say, you've decided on the killer? Understood. Then voting time. No, hold on a sec. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Why? Hajime's about to do what's called Sorry, a pro gamer. Just a little move. more. A pro gamer. I move. want you guys to wait just a little more. I can't help but feel like. There's still something we overlooked. Like who the traitor is? But the issue here is who killed Nagito, right? Even That's me, though. It's like, the traitor, seriously. The conclusion won't trap. change. That's true, but... The mystery isn't just about who the traitor is. But everything. No matter huh? how you look at it, Nagito's death is a suicide. But I'm a little worried, you know? I'm worried about starting the voting time while there's still a mystery. It's hey, what do you mean it's not about who the traitor is? What kind of mystery is left? Huh. <laughs> well, gang, looks like we got another mystery on There's our hands. There's one thing that doesn't make sense, and it relates to Nagito's death. Plus, it's something even Nagito couldn't influence. He couldn't even tamper with the evidence for it. Something related to Nagito's death, and it's something that he couldn't even tamper or, or mess with. You were gonna keep going? And here I thought we were finally finished. Um, something related to Nankito's death. A piece of evidence that he couldn't mess with. Great, I like how it just comes up before you can read it all. But you did, so it's fine. Alright, uh, well there's I a mean, lot of you things. you can also just do that. Wait, do this? There you go. What the? You know, you didn't oh, know you could do that? Oh, that's cool. It's convenient. That is convenient, okay. Uh, so there's a lot of things. However, what's really important? Um... Modern's notebook? Yeah, okay. Crap! What? Okay. 
then no. maybe it is. That's there's oh, some... the Monokuma file. Didn't didn't wasn't everyone talking about how strange it was? I see. Oh what? Whoa. Okay. Is it about the Monokuma file? Yeah, that's it. Huh? There was something suspicious in the Monokuma file. You just jumped file? a little ahead. Like yeah, I was thinking a little too. Forty ahead. minutes into the future. <laughs> too. <laughs> His early. fingers look weird. <laughs> the victim is Nagito Komaeda. The body was discovered inside the warehouse near the Monokuma Fleshy Factory. The estimated time of death is believed to be noon sharp. Not only is there a spear stabbed in his stomach, there are also multiple stab wounds on each of his thighs. Furthermore, there's a laceration on his left arm and a knife impaled oh, in his right hand. Oh, I see what's missing now. The suspicious part of the Monokuma file that Shiaki is worried about is... What's it? What's hidden in the Monokuma file? Oh, what? Stop. No, well, this time I can actually read from it. Hold on. I already know. You got it? Yep. Nope. <laughs> time of death. That's what I was thinking. No, it's noon sharp, but it does have to do with something... Of the time? Something of death. Something of death. Something of death. Oops. <laughs> I'm not. I forgot. Freight. Okay. Oh, of course it's gonna. Mm, I hate you. Uh, uh -huh. Oh, bazinga. Ah. Really? This is too much, dude. Ah. This is why I hate him. This is. I hate it. <laughs> oh it's my god. so bad! There's like no way to be doing this. I just have to freaking. Uh oh. God, man, that was terrible. That was so bad. That's not fair at all. In this particular case is Monokuma file. There's no specific cause of death. Key term being I hate specific. it. <laughs> Turn Super Saiyan. No. Not only there's spear stab in his stomach, okay. Furthermore, yeah. How did you die? Isn't that weird? That's a great Until question. Now, Good question. I've always specified the cause of death, but the cause of death is obvious, is it not? I'm sure about that. The spear in Nagito's stomach. It is obvious just by looking at it that it was the cause of death. In the Monokuma file. I like how he to spell out cause of death. Well, Monokuma. You had to spell out wolf, and you had no idea what it was. Ah, yeah, I know. The fifth. I'm so appalled that I have nothing to say. The wolf thing. Even during Gundam's case, and before during Nikon's case, the thing he purposely omitted from the Monokuma file was always the most important mystery in the case. Are you saying that applies this time too? Yep. Ho hold on a sec. Then are you saying there's more to Nagito's death? Yep. Are you suggesting again that his death wasn't a suicide? You guys were the ones who said it was a suicide in the first place. No, I don't think it's a mistake to call Nagito's death a suicide. But, but, it's not just a suicide. Come it's to think of it, and a suicide. Did Nagito really? Really commit suicide just to get us all killed? Are That's a great question. For him? That's not what I meant. I mean it in a bad sense. Bad sense? I just remembered that his malice always defied our expectations. And that concerns me. Isn't this exciting? For example, oh, that wow. malice yeah. just end here? Huh? Did Nagito's malice it's exciting, all right. for a truth we'd reach this easily? I mean, this is Nagito we're talking about, you know? <laughs> How interesting! You sure do believe in Nagito, huh? huh? He believed in them. Because you believe in his malice, you continue to suspect his malice. I see. I guess that's what passes for friendship these days. What friendship? What should we do, passes guys? For should we proceed with the vote? Oh yes, I think no. We should <laughs> keep going until everyone is satisfied. Oh yes, let's vote. <laughs> Even if it's just to be safe. All right, I'm out. I'm out of here. I'm about to head out. Leon killed Nagito. We only get one chance to vote, after all. Just to be safe, huh? Guess I have no choice. If that's the case, I'll do my best to go along with it. This is friggin' annoying. But if you guys say you're doing it, there's no way I'm gonna back out. Hey, Monokuma, you heard us. 
The voting's gonna have to wait! We've come this far. Let's work hard till the very end. If we work together, everything should be all right. Thanks, Shiaki. That's what I believe. Oh, splendid. You guys are so splendid right now. Oh. <laughs> That's right. If all your hopes are united, no despair can shake you. If your hopes are denied, denied. If denied. all your hopes are united, no despair can shake you. Huh. Denied. That's what I think about it. Nagito said the same thing. Yep. Oh, you could say the it absolute in his voice. hope can overcome any you despair. Say it in his voice. The absolute hope can overcome any despair. He said he was yearning for that. Then the situation we're in might be the thing that <laughs> Nagito wanted all along. <laughs> thing. Every yellow text is just gonna be a Nagito. No, no, never, never mind. mind. Sonia, Sonia, never mind. I'm probably overthinking. <laughs> Alright, was that the end of the first half? Yep. Suspended. Alright, wait, Mama, you can no, read. No, yeah. man, my heart is racing like crazy when I thought the voting time was gonna start, but. Well, if you think about it rationally, there's no way it was gonna happen. We haven't done this bit yet. Most of the players probably figured that out too. You're the only one who didn't know. Isn't that right, Monami? Hey, how much longer are you planning to sulk? Let's get along like we always do. They never get along. All right, you passed. Friendship is measured by how long you can stand in the silence when you're all alone with someone else. So, Monami and I are the bestest of best friends! Get out. <laughs> Don't say such stupid things. I, I I hate you so much right now. Enough! Why do I have to be hated that much? Besides, the fact that you snap at me like that, I don't trust you at all. You have even, not even a teensy tiny bit, one millimeter bit. How sad. Destruction your friend is much more shameful than being betrayed by that friend, you know? We aren't even friends in the first place! Then as your older brother, let me say this! You're not even my brother! It's sad to live a life without friendship! That's even sadder than watching a high school rom-com full of guys! Well, there are many... Uh, there may be some demands for that. ha wa 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 I fell for it, I totally took the man... man bait! Ugh! Alright. I'm Monami, and my heart's dropping like crazy right now. Jeez. Okay. Just do this last one, but then I'll... Yeah, well, not yet. Okay. Alright, guys. Monami. By now, there's nothing more for me to say. Okay, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys. In the next episode, we're gonna do the next half of the trial and figure out where I'm gonna save. <laughs> I'm just joking. Um, and figure out if Nagito really did kill himself or not. Well, this is getting insane. I bet the next half is even more exciting. Uh, hope you liked the video, comment down below, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next adventure of Nolan's Art. Bye! Bye.